question the figure shows a painter uh, in a crate which hangs along a building when the painter pulls the rope the force he exerts on the floor of the crate is 300 newtons mass of the painter and the crate are 75 and 25 respectively what is the acceleration of the crate so let's say he pulls with a tension of t definitely the same tension x over here and a force due to gravity x on the painter and a normal reaction also acts on the painter uh, uh, let me use a different color so the blue one represents the fbd on the painter and the black one is now represents the forces acting on the crate so that's t uh, that's a normal reaction on the opposite side which acts because of this normal reaction uh, 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 i mean action and reaction and then there's a force of gravity and let's say the complete system is moving up with acceleration of A. So if we write the two equations of motion on the crate and the man, let's say on the painter, that will be T plus normal reaction minus M1G is equal to M1A. Normal reaction is already given to us as 300. So that's 300 minus M1 is 75. So 75G is equal to 75A. Uh, we, have to find, we need to find the acceleration. So let's call it equation 1. And likewise, the, uh, this is the one on the painter and the equation on the crate is going to be likewise, uh, it will be T, <clears throat> it will be uh, T minus N minus M to G is equal to M to A. So this will be T minus 300 minus 25 G is equal to 25 A. Let's call it equation 2. So from first and second, we can eliminate T, right? So let's subtract 1 and 2 so that the T and minus T is cancelled and it becomes 0. So it will become 300 minus 75 G minus minus 300 minus 25 G is equal to 75 A minus 25 A. 300 plus 300, why plus? Because minus and minus is plus. So it will become 600. And this is minus and minus is plus as well. So minus 75 plus 25 will be minus 50G is equal to 50A. So all we have to do is divide both sides by 50, I think. So if we do that, 600, uh, it should be 12 minus 9.8, I think, which is coming as 2.2. So if we divide both sides by 50, the value of A comes out as 2.2. And as the final answer is 2.2 meter per second square, which is the acceleration of this complete system. Thank you.